everyone. I'm Sharon Tay in for Sylvia Lopez. And I'm Lena Wynn. KKL 9 News at 9 starts right now. Tomorrow, Iowa Republicans will come together for one of the biggest challenges so far in the young 2012 presidential campaign. The Iowa straw poll is a key nominating contest. It's a huge test for the GOP candidates, and it gives the base a chance to have crucial say on the direction of the party. KCAL 9's Emily Schmidt reports the GOP presidential hopefuls took to the soapbox to win over voters. All right, the weekend is here. So are you ready for a warm-up? Well, we're ready for a warm-up, but Jackie Johnson's going to tell us whether oh. or not it's going to happen. Right, Jackie? Jackie? Secretary of State Hillary Clinton wants more international pressure put on Syria's president. She says the Assad regime's brutality is galvanizing global opinion against the leader, and she wants more done to isolate him. Secretary Clinton stopped short of directly calling on Assad to step down, but she says Syria would be better off without him. One bright spot in the U.S. economy. Why? The number of jobless here in California remains among the highest in the country. Casey Wyan shows us two cities where one is at the top and the other is at the bottom of the state's unemployment chart. Well, there's a lot going on this weekend. We've got uh, Stephanie's Day here on we the have so uh, much CBS going lot. On. You're going to be mm -hmm. there, yeah? Yeah, I'm a gonna, lot of and us you're going to be there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so it's going to be a lot of fun, and you'll get to meet Stephanie. She's so adorable. Yeah. Really nice. <laughs> anyway, nice Jackie Johnson, um, you are here with our weekend forecast. You know, I just got to say this, TGIF. Oh, right. Right. oh my gosh. <laughs> with the new presidential campaign underway, the man political.com recently called a conservative heartthrob is gearing up for a busy political season. He's not running for anything, but if recent campaigns are any indication, entertainer Pat Boone will be a factor in 2012. KCAL 9 political reporter Dave Bryan joins us now with more on. Well, British Prime Minister David Cameron is calling on an old hand to help with the riots in his country. Former LAPD chief Bill Bratton. Well, despite the troubled economy, U.S. wine growers are enjoying the sweet taste of success. The vintages made here are uh, much more economical than their counterparts made in France. KCAL 9's Sandra Endo reports American wine lovers are savoring the savings. Well, we were comparing uh, Tiger Woods last night to the stock market, and if mm. we continue to do that, maybe we're talking recession at this yeah, point. Yeah, I know. The wild swings on Wall Street this week certainly kept investors on pins and needles, so you can only imagine what it's like for the traders. KCAL 9's Jim Axelrod shows us how the roller coaster ride is becoming the new norm on the trading floor. And that's going to do it for us here on KCAL 9 News at 9. There's more ahead. KCAL 9 News at 10 starts right now.